All right, what we have here is a Casio HT3000. It's a Casio from the 80s. It's a spectrum dynamic synthesizer. I don't know what that means, but it has an analog filter. It has one LFO that controls the volume. And uh, you got five different waveforms for the LFO. You got 31 different waveforms for the oscillator. Uh, you got an analog filter that you can edit the cutoff resonance and the, uh, the envelope for the, for the uh, filter. And you could also edit the amplitude, the ADSR envelope for the sound also. So let's go through some of the waveforms. All right. Starting with zero. That sounds kind of like a saw. Waveform number two. Number three. Number four. Five. It's like a noise oscillator. Basically, those are your waveforms, your oscillators that you can pick. Let's start with. That sounds kind of like a saw. And then we can go down to the uh, the mode button and we start messing with the envelope, actually the filter, because it is an analog filter. I want to show all you guys the analogness of it. So let's go into the resonance, turn up the resonance a little bit. Let's go into the cutoff and do like a sweep. Yeah, basically that's the filter. That's the highlight of this keyboard right here, is the analog filter. We're just applying it to a saw waveform. And you could also set the, uh, the filter attack, the decay, sustain, and release, and also adjust the uh, envelope depth of the filter. So if you wanted to uh, mess with the uh, envelope depth, you go to Get it to quack a little bit. Quack like a duck. Quack, quack, quack. That's a filter attack. That's the filter attack I'm messing with right there. So basically, there's a lot of sound editing possibilities on this thing. I'm just go straight into the uh, the preset sounds because uh, that'll give you an idea of what can be programmed, I guess, what this keyboard can do. The first one is a piano. Harpsichord. Jazz organ. See the modulation wheel. Thank you. 
That's just noise. Sounds like just the resonance of the filter. Let's go into the internal sound bank, which are also presets. This has an analog chorus in it, but no reverb. the uh, sounds over there and there's also a split mode and there's 10 more presets over here Sounds quite lovely, as the English would say. This is not your mama's Casio. This is your grandmama's Casio. Old school. So yeah, let's go through some of these uh, beats that are in here. 
some uh, 8 bit, 10 bit, bit beats. I don't know exactly what it is, but. Nice, dirty, warm character to him. Cheesy, lo-fi goodness. Sounds pretty damn fat for some PCM sounds. over here where you could mix the accompaniment the rhythm with the actual thing you're playing Casio HT3000.